Hello everybody, hope you're doing well. Welcome back to a new video on the channel. What we are doing is gate two of the Radical Raid quest, and I thought, well, you know, it's not many, not much stuff happening in MCOC. Let's go get, uh, let's go get grinding. We're in a bit of a lull period. I've done EOP. Yes, there's cavalier difficulty do, but I'll save that for live stream so everyone can come and uh, chill and watch as we play different things. And I thought what I'd do is I just kind of get into experimenting around with some champions. We'll do all the difficulties. Well, we'll do Epic Cavalier and or Epic Legendary and uh, what is it called? Uh, Elder difficulty in this particular video. And also gives me a chance to like just uh, chat and, and talk about things. So what I'm doing right now is I'm building up a lovely little Wolverine here to uh, to an SP, an SP, well, SP2 so you can throw it at me. That's the first thing. Uh, come on, AI, throw special attack. Throw, throw special attack. Is this a, is this a thing at the moment with MCC? Oh yes, well, I'm not going to throw the special attack, uh, but we're going to throw in an SP2. Try and reverse some of that healing back, which is on there for a limited time only. Uh, we're going to be very aggressive, and yeah, there we go. Gear team 299, cool answer. Um, just experimenting around Nimrod. Other champions can be very handy on this particular route. As I said, we're doing epic. Right, let's try that again in legendary difficulty. Oh, a bit, well, I've got five energy refills to go. I mean, I've got six overall. I just used one. Um, it's, it's not great having to spend energy in this one, but, you know, take or leave it. It is what it is. I'm going to try out... I think I'm going to go Human Torch with this one and do the Incinerates, just so it's different. Yeah. Let's just kind of like... Let's, let's try and see if we can do some stuff with um, Incinerates here. And just see, like... How 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 they do? See, there we go. We're I've got to remember to do medium light mean. It's just trying to remember the um, not the method, but you can see there we're suppressing. You do need to kind of like keep up the aggression there with it. I think it's like a medium light medium on it. I mean, it seems to be doing some. I could be doing it wrong. I mean, it seems to be it seems to be doing the job. So. I can't kind of go like, oh, you're not doing it wrong. But um, it was suppressing. So long may it suppress. Um, seems to do fine there. Just nice to mix it up, really, for it. Like, let's move on to Vision. And uh, again, Dr. Doom, I think I packed for this one. I say packed. Like, it's I, uh, I wanted to use for this one. There are multiple different uses. I'll probably put a link in the description to the spreadsheet. That, I mean, look, here's the thing. You don't have to follow the spreadsheet. I will be going back to the comments section of that particular video where I said about, you know, best teams and stuff and creations for the side quest. I'll be returning back to that one probably next, sometime next week. And, or maybe the week after, close to the, no, no, maybe next week, next week. And we'll kind of like go, okay, well, this is still kind of like a good team configuration and, and stuff uh, for this. And going, okay, well, you could use this one, this one, this one, this one, and this one. And all that stuff. You can throw a special? Gonna throw a special? Gonna throw a special? I don't know, Matt. Some was, AI is just so weird. You can take a Doom Slap, mate. I kind of want your power, though. Yeah, the AI is just kind of moving very strangely at me. I, when that happens, I'm like, mm, not quite sure about this, Chief. Gonna have to really think about my um, my play and kind of uh, changing up a little bit. Because you never know. Like this thing, a lot of the time you go, yeah, can we trust the AI to kabam throw? Possibly not. But job is done. We move on to the boss. Um, and maybe I can get, I did notice as well, my poisons weren't consistently coming on. I mean, again, it happens. RNG happens with MCOC. You take the rough with the smooth with it. So, yep, uh, onto this boss. As I said, like, my favourite is going uh, against the Tumor and is using White Magneto. And any champion really works as long as you've got that passive parry because it helps against kind of the building of... Um, is it con Yeah, building of concussions because he purifies so quickly. So we go, like, we go parry, we do heavy attack. And we've got to work fast as well. And then we do have, that's the other thing we do have, um, the spiked armor, I want to say. There we go. So it's good already. I've got some poisons. I do need to keep him close. What's going on? Honestly, the AI is seriously giving me uh, serious PTSD with this. Because I'm like, what's happening here? Um, Got to watch out for that as well. Because, yes, you do, um, uh, you do have that kind of like stun that can be shrugged off. Or 
purified from it. So it's good, good to watch out for that. But that passive parry and kind of doing that parry technique is normally the best. Right, okay, that's, that's legendary done. Let's move on now to elder difficulty. Come on, Kabam! Look at the lag! The lag! Okay, on to Elder Difficulty now. We're going to finish off the uh, the video with that. I'm going to go back to Guillotine 2099. I want to um, build up the champion. Uh, seven stars, Banner Man. I know some people like it, but I just think it's a bit funny in some, in some cases. Uh, also, if you get hit, I think it's Dismay, isn't it? The other node that's on you, so you've got to watch out for Dismay. Man, I'm doing so, I'm, it's really weird against seven stars to be doing as much damage as I am, but maybe that's because of, you know, the... Um, Extent of, come on. Oh, look at the ticks of that. This is going to be the thing about how aggressively I play and how aggressively I'm able to kind of uh, shut down certain things. Because, like, now we've got the... We've got that effect on. So we're, we're definitely, like, reversing the power. Maybe it was a case, like, I don't know, a Magneto might have been best here. Especially if the champion is not throwing special attacks. But I'm doing... I'm You know, I shouldn't really complain because it's, like, still... Taking down the damage, we're reversing back the healing. Would something like Guillotine OG be good for this one? Yeah, possibly. Uh, as long as I don't flop, I should do a parry heavy attack in a second. Because I've got... Ooh, that was, ooh, I've got to watch out for these inputs. Uh, not inputs. The AI. Sometimes it's coming at me, sometimes it's not. Okay, so we're nearly put up to SB2. This may be a slower way of dealing with it, but here's the thing. If you want to get up to, like, your 100 hits... And that's just the thing, like now, I want to be thinking about, am I going to use this champion in the next fight? Guillotine 2099 does rely on you doing that SP3 to finish. So again, I've got to think about that. But also, I've got to think about the idea of, um, I am over 100 hits, great, but... Oh my god, he's not going to throw it. Yes, he does. Um, yeah, I've got to think about my SP3 now. Am I out, out damaging as well? Because I've got to think about that. Out damaging against the champions... Regeneration. We could be a little bit of a hit. The take could take a little bit of time, folks. Uh, but as I said, I really want to get that SP3 finish because then if I want to use my Guillotine 2099 in the next fight, like now, like, I've got to guarantee myself we're doing five percent damage in order to kind of like uh, take onto the. Yes, there we go. So just going to prove that point. If for whatever reason I wanted to use uh, Guillotine 2099 in the next fight, which that's good. Do these objectives then that would be important. So like we'll give an example here. We're going to go into the um, the fight against Vision. Now, I don't re I'm just thinking like pre-fights. Do I kind of like load up the champion with anything great with pre-fights? Do I want what do I what do I want? Like am I thinking I'm going to lose anything when it comes to to, to damage? Uh life steal, power burn. I might do power burn to be honest cuz like that's probably going to be beneficial for me against Vision, especially if he goes into his, uh, what is it, Synthesize. So let's give it a go. Like, I might fail on this one, but um, hey, it's it's all about like trying something different. I don't want to do this this video and go, oh, I use exactly the same champions in exactly the same, uh, you know, thing. Good that we've got the power burn right off the bat, right off the rip. Um, both champions on this path seem to have some kind of regeneration function, which is fantastic. That means I can get my SP2 around, but at the same time, ah, oh, man, I just thought about it. I need to do a parry heavy attack. There we go, just to get my combo shielded, because, you know, I'm, I'm comboing nicely. And also get this power right there. Oh, God, that is touching. Fine, isn't it, Richard? Right, okay. Oh, 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 <laughs> okay. Gotta wa I've really got to watch out for that, about champion synthesizing. As much as it's, it, I want to be aggressive, because look at the damage, man. 3k on the, uh, the D-Gens is nice. I can play aggressively as I like. We then suppress on that. Perfect, love it. Also made a little bit of a mistake. I haven't. I just realised I haven't taken down uh, Shuri, and I already kind of packed. Apart from I could, I went across to the. Uh, I can't. There's no do overs, sadly, so I couldn't go back to do Shuri in this one. So maybe in future videos we'll, we'll go against Shuri. And I did want to use Human Torch, especially because of his way of kind of dealing with Miss. So yeah, uh, bit of a silly, silly moment, silly. But you know, look, you know, this is. Um, this is fun. I'm having. Um, oh, 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 I got it. That's the thing to watch out for. He he gonna purify it. He's gonna purify it. So watch out for the purification because look, that's that's the thing. You can't be that quick of going. We well, doesn't allow you to be that quick of going in uh, right there. Okay, one special attack there. Can we swipe back and we go into 
Yep, that one. And then we're going to do another heavy attack. I love swipe back and throwing a special attack. That's quite nice. Now, how this is going to play out is... You think he should just, like... Is he going to... He's going to, he's going to stay alive from this. Six. Five. Oh, see, plenty of distance, man. Plenty of distance. My back's against the wall. Get your back up off the wall. Tell my baby, get down. Yeah. So that's been it. That's been gate two. Um, used a few different champions. Uh, pretty fun. As I said, I should have really gone and uh, gone right. I made a mistake. I mean, the problem is when you create a team, like, okay, well, this is going to do one path. You then go like, um, I don't know, your mind goes on auto. I go on auto fight. And I, I'm next one, I'll probably do like uh, take down Shuri with some champions. Yeah, uh, I don't know if anybody wants to check out the spreadsheet, which is uh, link is in the description. That's a nice amount of shards to pick up from this particular uh, this particular one. Yeah, uh, if you want to check out link in the description. That's been a video. Thank you very much for watching. Have a lovely day. Um, yeah, bye-bye for now, everybody. Cheers. Have a good one. Bye.